A useful feature of the Animation and Drawing by Doink app is its trace feature. It enables you to trace a reference image to create a drawing. In this tutorial, we will show you how to draw the state of Texas. First, launch the Animation and Drawing by Doink app, and it will put you in the gallery view. Tap the plus button in the upper right corner. Then tap New Drawing in the drop-down menu. Tap the layer icon in the upper toolbar, which is the icon in the middle with three horizontal lines. A drop-down menu will appear. Tap the camera icon and then choose a photo from your album. In this case, a map of Texas that you will use as your reference image. Tap Use. You will notice the app puts your photo in the top layer. What you want to do is move it down one layer so that you can trace over it. Do this by tapping the layer icon to the far right and drag the layer to the bottom. Then tap the top layer to indicate this is now the layer you're working on. It will be highlighted in blue. Tap outside the layer to return to the editor. Select a fill color from the basic palette. In this case, choose a black. Then tap the brush tool icon on the toolbar. Choose the size of your brush by using the slider. Outline the state of Texas by tracing over your photo. Make sure to close in your shape completely so that when you use the app's fill tool, the color only fills within the shape and doesn't bleed out. Now let's view just the outline. Tap the layer icon on the upper toolbar. Decrease the opacity of your photo layer, which is the bottom layer, by tapping it and then move the opacity slider to zero. Your reference photo now disappears and all you see is your outline. If you're happy with it, fill in your shape. Do this by tapping the palette icon and then choosing a blue color. Tap the paint bucket icon and then tap anywhere within the outline shape to fill in your color. Your drawing is now complete and automatically saved to your gallery with your reference image removed. You now have a drawing that can be used in other compositions in our animation app or in our green screen app as shown in the beginning of this tutorial. Awesome job!